video I'm going to be using the 24 day cycle to ascertain ovulation date, date, the, the fertile days, the safe days of this 24 day cycle. If you're interested in that, hit the subscribe button. Let's get started. Now, I want us to first look at this. For first, we are going to determine the ovulation date. Now, for the ovulation date, ovulation date, usually you have to get the number of days in a cycle, which is usually 24, and then you're going to subtract 14 days. Okay, so you get 24 minus 14, you get 10. Okay, so you're going to look at this, this amount, this is the x axis, okay, this, this, and then you're going to get this 24 put minus 24 minus 14 which gives you the 10th so ovulation is around the 10th day of the cycle okay and the 10th day of the cycle is this okay okay just so you know that that usually the ovulation is usually characterized by what they call the lh surge okay which is the latinizing hormone surge usually that hormone increases towards ovulation and then goes down with after ovulation okay that is known as the lh surge so usually for more confirmation of those for the ovulation date usually additional tests testing for this hormone can be done to confirm the exact ovulation date now another thing to remember is that if an ovum usually the egg stays viable for 12 up to 24 hours after ovulation so whenever you determine this 10th day this is the 10th day of, of the cycle. So that means the, the egg is viable up to 24 hours. That means from the 10th to the 11th day, we have the most fertile day of your menstrual cycle. Okay. So that means these are the two most fertile days of this 24 day cycle. From the 9th day up to the 10th day and from the 10th day up to the 11th day of the cycle. Okay. Now, another concept I want you to remember is that is that a sperm okay just let me wrap this a little bit a sperm is viable for three to five days okay a sperm is viable for three up to five days so that means that that means that calculating the safe days and the fatal and the unsafe or the fatal days we have to put this into consideration these five days so for 25 for 24 day cycle get this ovulation date the 10th day of the cycle subtract five days okay so it's going to be 10 minus 5 okay so it's going to be 5 so up to 5 okay here okay let's remember that and then i want you to get the again get this 10 plus 5 okay so it's going to be around the 15th day okay so these from the fifth day up to the 15th day of this cycle these are what they call the unsafe days okay these are the unsafe unsafe days of the cycle okay remember that from the fifth day up to the 15th day those are the unsafe days of a 24 day cycle however the other days from 15th from 15th up to 24 those are safe safe then from 0 up to 5 these are safe days okay okay so those are the safe days so from the 15th up to 24th and then from from 1 up to 5 those are the safe days of the cycle so we already have the ovulation date so we have so i've shown you how to calculate the ovulation ovulation date i've shown you how to calculate the safe days and the unsafe days okay now i want you to do me one favor please just make sure you subscribe to my youtube channel and join the family for more health related videos okay See you next time.